Alrighty, well, we got a little reprieve from the rain here. <laughs> so we're back at it. I think I've decided on the uh, height of my bed now, so we're good to go. Probably gonna do anywhere from two feet to two and a half feet kind of width on the bed. Um, so I'll be sitting about right here and I'll have my counter space in this area. And just enough headroom to get under this. Whatever this thing is. As for the hatches, somebody mentioned in the comments that I should use like uh, a finger pull little lift area, like what they actually use in sailboats and, and things like that. And that's a really good idea. I think they look really sharp. So that's what I'm gonna go with. So thank you, Alex, for that suggestion. Definitely gonna be using that in the van. I'm gonna try and get the flooring pretty much done today. Um, and then over the next few days while it's raining, I can worry about window stuff, you know, things that can be done inside the van. Anyways, I'm gonna run to the store, take a look at some vinyl and other type of flooring options. And then I also need to get some smaller screws because my um my flooring is like half inch flooring and like all my screws are, are just a little bit too long um, for things like the hatches and, and other little things like that. So let's get on over to the hardware stores. So the linoleum options over at the Home Depot wasn't working out. So we're gonna check out this place. I got some surplus stuff. Uh, see if they have some linoleum that I don't have to buy in gigantic pieces. Yeah, so they were closed. We, whatever, we got some screws, so <laughs> I'm just gonna put that back panel for this area on and uh, I guess call it a day. Oh well, wasted a good day. <laughs> All right, so fits in. It's a little snug on that side. I'm just gonna take it out and sand that area down because you know how it is here. Uh, good enough G is good enough when it comes to this van. All right, we have finally gotten our hands on some uh, some vinyl. And I got this from that surplus store. So we'll go ahead and get that cut out. I don't know if we're gonna actually put it down officially today, but. We'll try to get it cut out so it's ready to be puttied on or whatever you're supposed to do to get this linoleum to stick. Alright, got it laid down. So I'm just going to clamp it temporarily at a few points and then just go underneath and mark out all the areas and a little bit of excess and stuff that I'll need to cut off. Um, but yeah, I like it. It looks nice. Feels like it's high quality. I thought the boards were a little bit thinner. They're pretty, pretty big sized boards, but I think that's, I think that's fine. All right, got the linoleum all cut out where the trap doors will be. And then linoleum also cut to go on top of them. That's we'll to be trimmed out a little bit to make it work, but it's not, not bad at all. Not gonna glue it down right now because it's gonna be raining for a little while. Um, so I wanna do this on a drier day, but it's getting there. And here's what it looks like back inside the van. All right, so like I mentioned, we're gonna be having rain for the next few days, so. Coming up soon will be window stuff. Um, <laughs> and then as soon as it starts getting sunnier and I'm not working, we'll get this linoleum glued or plastered down or whatever it is you're supposed to do to make it stick. Anyways, thanks for watching. <laughs>